We're going to take a look at some broody Muscovy ducks today. I'm going to show you their behaviour and we're going to look at some that aren't broody as well so that you can see the difference. That way you're going to know when you've got a broody Muscovy duck in your flock. Hi guys, I'm Elisa and welcome to Moat Cottage Homesteading. When a duck goes broody, it means she's inclined to sit on eggs, that she's moody or gloomy. So when your duck goes broody, you may notice that she stays on her nest all day and doesn't come off. Even if you're collecting the eggs, she will even sit on an empty nest. If you get too close, she'll hiss at you to protect her nest, although it's more like heavy breathing. Or she might prefer to make a chattering noise to warn you off. But mostly they'll just sit on their nest quietly. None of these girls are broody. They're all walking around quite casually. They've got their heads up nice and tall and they're quite chilled out. So they're not broody. However, this girl at the back is broody. See how her feathers are all fluffed out and she's walking quite puffy. Usually when a broody hen comes off the nest, she's really thirsty. So she'll stop at every water bowl there is available and have a drink. And look at how fanned out her tail is, especially when you compare it to the white duck in the background, how it's more pointed. Her tail is really fanned out. And her feathers are all sort of separated, puffed out. And she occasionally makes a little bit of noise just to let everybody know that she's there and to keep away from her, I think. When she walks, her head's right back. And if you look at the other girls, their heads are up. can get a better look. Her chest is really puffed out. Quite often when a muscovy duck comes off the nest for her one a day outing, she likes to have a bath. She'll have something to eat as well and she'll give herself a clean, nice clean. We're looking at six females here, and as you can see, none of them are broody. They're all quiet, chilled out, their heads are all up, no one's puffy. But when a little silver girl comes in to scream, you can see that she's got a bit of an attitude, she's puffed up. She's ready to head back to her nest now but she won't go there while we're watching. Of course, I know where her nest is, but she'll wait until we're not paying attention to go there. Now you can easily identify when you have a broody muscovy duck in your backyard. And if you want to learn more about backyard muscovy ducks, then check out my playlist. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. 